Hey everyone, it's Judy. Welcome to week four of Love is in the Air, YouTube Hop, and Metal, In Love with Metal, YouTube Hop. I always forget to mention that. This is hosted by none other than Elemental Designs and Crafting with Isabel Labori. I am so excited that it has been such an awesome three weeks. You guys have been so kind and with your words and the other ladies have been so creative. I have just been so blown away by the awesome things that they have created in metal and in paper and it, it's just been so much fun. And I hope you guys are enjoying it as much as I have been. I have been truly inspired. This week, our challenge was to um, redo a paintbrush. It had to be at least three inches wide, and mine is exactly three inches. I got it at the Dollar Tree. So, here's what I did. This was... A belt buckle. I had my husband snip off the insides and that took off the uh, whatever that goes through the leather. So I repurposed it for a frame. So I first of course gessoed, then I painted, then I added this beautiful trim. I absolutely love this. And I got this at uh, Pamela Joy's Facebook group. It's called Pamela Joy Art Group. And every Monday she posts new trims and, and images and different things like that. It's, it's very, very nice for reasonable prices. But anyway, besides that. Uh, I put a beautiful applique up at the on the handle and I put a flower over the hole after I added my hanging ribbon because I actually had somebody send me a beautiful altered paintbrush but I have no way to hang it up unless I want to try and put a hanger on the back somehow. But anyway, um... So I put my ribbon through first, and then I put my flower over the hole. I used a metal butterfly I got from Monica, scrapping for my boys, and she has some more for sale. Uh, of course, I had to use my dangle trims. Y'all know I love my dangles. Love my dangles. So that I got that too at Pamela Joy. Um... And then I used some different flowers that I had. I just kind of clustered them together and some leaves and a couple little pieces of doily. Um, I cut apart because you end up covering the whole doily and it can be used several times if I just cut off pieces here and there. So that is my uh, paintbrush. I'm very pleased with how it came out. Again, I tried not to go over the top. Oh, and I did add a ribbon here, which was kind of silly because you can't see it from here. But, oh well. I just thought it was pretty. So, that is my uh, uh, challenge for this week, week four. Remember, you have to comment and like on all five of my videos. And then, after next week... I will be doing a drawing, maybe two, depending on how many comments I have. But definitely go and check out the other ladies. They have all been phenomenal. And I have really enjoyed watching this hop. Now, next week, I guarantee you, you will be blown away. And I am very excited, and it is way out of my comfort zone. But you know what? I'm going out of town, so I have to knock it out in the next two days. So wish me luck. 
So we will see. Um, but I am very excited to share every week with you guys because you guys have been so encouraging and I appreciate all of you. I hope you have a blessed day. Go check out the other ladies and remember to be kind to one another. Bye-bye.